Hey everyone, it's Adam with UploadWP.com and in this video I want to address a question from one of our forum members. Uh, specifically they're looking to customize the Mistyle theme so that the main navigation here is moved down to reduce the white space and then up here just below the search box they want to put a widget section uh, so that they can put their social media icons there and link to their account. So that's what I'm going to show you how to do in this video. Um, here's our demo site that we're going to do it on. Um, so we're going to move this navigation down here so it's closer to this double line and then up in this section right here we're going to put a widget a uh, custom widget box so that you can add social media uh, icons or whatever you want up there okay so to get started the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go into the admin and we're going to go to appearance and editor and here uh, the style sheet style.css we're going to paste the following let's see let's go back out to the upload WP community forums and if you scroll down I have uh, the CSS right here so we're gonna go ahead and copy this and just go ahead and paste it right here and make sure you use, you're using a uh, mistyle child theme as we are right here alright so I pasted that in let's go ahead and update the file alright step two we're gonna click on functions.php and then right here we're going to paste the following again if we go to the forum uh, we have the PHP right here so we'll go ahead and copy it and then paste it in and then I'm going to go ahead and update that file okay the next step we're going to add a header.php file to our child theme so to do that I'm going to again go to the forum and you can see I have uh, the header.php uh, right here so I'm gonna go ahead and copy all of this Oops. All right. so go ahead and copy it and then I'm gonna open up uh, notepad plus plus and I'm gonna go ahead and just paste it in there and then I'm gonna save it as header.php okay so I'm gonna save it as header.php and save file. Okay, so now I've saved that in Notepad. Uh, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to open up FileZilla or whatever FTP client you use. Go ahead and connect. And then let's go find our site. Okay, and then we're going to go to WP content themes find your child theme and open it up so now we're in our child theme and I'm gonna take uh, the header.php file we just uh, created and drag and drop it in okay that's it so now I've uploaded it to or I've uploaded header.php to my child theme so I'm gonna go back out to our site and again I'm on appearance and editor and I'm just gonna go ahead and refresh the page and header.php should show up over here so there it is, there's our header.php file. Um, so as a last step, what we're going to do now is go to Appearance and Widgets. And you can see now we have our custom top right widget section created. So um, what I would do if I was going to display social media icons is I would go ahead and just grab a text widget and drag it up here. And in here I'd paste my HTML for my social media icons. Uh, in this case I'm just going to write in social media icons go here but again since it's a widget section you can use it however you want uh, so let's go take a look at the site and refresh the page you can see the navigation has been moved down to reduce the white space here and here's our custom widget section where you could have your social media icons so that's how to do it um, and again you can get uh, the code that we used here if you go out to the Upload WP community forums. Thanks for taking time to watch this video and I'll see you in the next one.